<clears throat> mm. So, I know it's been a while since I've uploaded, and I have no excuse this time, and I'm not going to say anything, but I'm sorry. And I'm going to try, again, upload once a week, if not once every two weeks, but I've been working on this for a while, and I know this video is long, so I'm going to keep this quick and short. I hope you guys enjoy. I spent a lot of time into this. I know I'm really late to this, but please like and subscribe. This means a lot to me. And without further ado, I will let you enjoy the video. By the way, I just want to give a disclaimer. This isn't a guide. This is just my monkey brain trying to explain steps that I don't understand. So if you're looking for a guide, this isn't it. This is just us fucking around. But starting with the opening, this was like an intro to the whole raid and what it was about, aka the light orbs. This, this will be in every encounter and this will be everything you do. And I mean everything. So what this light orb does is when someone picks it up, the light orb starts to fill. It's, there's a little bar and it starts to fill up. Once it gets max, you have eight seconds for your teammate to grab it off of you before you go, you know, a little kaboom. And once they take it, you get an enlightened ability, which will be used for like a lot of things throughout this raid. But for the opening and for now, all you need to know was we were just playing hot potato with it. And it took us about 20 minutes to realize that you had to deposit the enlightening thing in to start building the bridge. I don't ask me. It took 20 minutes and this was just not a good start. Oh. So yeah, and then we, we all got to stand out here on the plate to form the bridge. But then as that once that bar gets full, you just say someone take it. Round and see how far it is. It doesn't look like it's gone up at all. No, nope. I say it just it just. Oh yeah, I see the knife. I just you had to I had to enlighten. Yep, I say it. yeah, you gotta get enlightened. Yay. Wait, do I jump there? No, I don't. And with the opening out of the way, we basically just built a bridge and jumped down a really deep and dark hole. Pause. <laughs> So, welcome to the second encounter, or as I like to call, Ikea, because the amount of lamps that just rail the living shit out of you. Oh, there's a fucking hole right there, watch out. Yeah, oh, watch fuck, out. I got boobed, shit, no, oh, God. Uh, For this one, it's really complicated. Like I said, this isn't a guide. I'll try to explain it the best I can, but basically you take the light orb, you go to a little pillar, you light it up, and then you keep on trading the light orb back and forth so you guys don't blow up. And this one was annoying us. This was our first challenge out of many in this run. It wasn't the ads, it was just the mechanic and the fucking lamps. Okay, so keep in mind, it's been like seven hours into the first encounter and we've been through like three or like more teams. I can't keep track. As you'll see, we'll switch around teams a lot. But what we found is that you can just skip half of it. And it got to the point where we were just so fed up. So we just found a way to skip half of it and it worked and it was fucking hilarious
Okay, so second encounter. Um, honestly, this really wasn't that bad. This was probably the shortest encounter of all four of them. Um, the ads weren't an issue. The main issue was just getting people over to the other side because the way this works is if you don't have two people on like a little plate, a nuke will go off. And the issue is just for us to stop a nuke from going off and also trying to get people to go from one side. But once we figured this out, it was actually pretty easy. But I mean, of course, from our amazing success from the first encounter, the first thing we try to do is just cheat it. Do this blind or do you just want to pull up raid secret? Let's, let's do it blind. We, we did the first part easily, yeah, okay? We're, we're going to find the smart way again. Watch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> shatter all skate right. all the way we to the end. We can just, we can just okay. well skate over there. Fuck I was it. about we to say just shatter just skate all the way to the end. We're all happy about completing the easiest encounter regarded in all of Dust. Yeah. Look, it's not easy for us, okay? <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we are within the lower IQ bracket. <laughs> I think it's just the four totems we have to keep active, okay. not the... Why are the, the wizards? Once, and once where the bridge is built, it's built, you know what I mean? What I, mean? Like, I, don't, I think, I think we have to kill a gatekeeper and then wizard spawns. Okay, the, the oh, wait! Yeah, he's... Oh! He's oh! Right. Yeah, but we still need to get the sword there. Oh, we would... But then we can have more people there. Yeah. Well, the thing is, the person that's going there needs to be good at that clear, basically. I... Spoiler alert, this is actually somewhat of a decent game, and none of these cheats worked. So, we had to do it the right way, the way it was intended. I know, disappointing. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Three. Two. Well, we're getting like way closer. I hope you guys see that. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, we are. Mm. Dip, are you, uh. Yeah, I'm on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, there you go. At least I know I'm gonna be able to teach this raid really well. Juicy, take. Nah, never mind. I'm enlightened. So, Felix, I'm take it to mustard. Right, I'm running back to mid, or should I get ready to pick it off, Juicy? Get ready to pick it off, Juicy. Get ready to pick it off, Juicy. And then do yeah, I just 50%. run for it? Uh, yeah. Dip has, planted. Dip has planted. Dip has yeah. planted. Dip has planted. You're good, you're good. Just believe. I'm just gonna strand it. Okay. Over here. Yep, I know. Are we done on bridge? Are we done on bridges? Run, 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 run. Yeah, yeah. get off, get off. You can get off, you can get off. Alright, good work, boys. Good okay. stuff. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, um, now just take a, take a breath. And then the three will figure it out. I'm ready for that. You're on the way? Okay. Okay. Time I'm when you're completely over bridge. so I can get off my plate. The bridge is not even there yet. What? Yeah, well, the then, bridge is just built. You could jump and smack, you'll be faster. Okay. I'm and here. everyone get off. Everyone get off. Everyone get off plates. Yep. Where am I going? Sorry, uh, heading my way. Okay, I see it. You see the guy? You see the guy? Blue guy? You can get off. You can get off. Yep, yep, yep. Waiting for Artemis. Hang on. I'm you're good, you're good. Take your time. I'm not trying to rush you. Oh, I was good. Take your time. Take your time. Okay. Don't rush. Don't All rush of over. you Take are going to have to grab a sword. I believe. Uh, there we go. Here it comes, here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. I don't know where it is yet. On spark, on spark, on spark. Everyone off, everyone off. On spark, on spark, everyone off. On spark. Yep. What now? Uh, we just keep going. Play. Play game. Wait. There's a pedestal, there's a pedestal. Do we have to enlighten here? I don't know. Yeah, 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 put your sword in there. No, 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 no. There's a pedestal in front of the, you know, what do you call There's it? a we barrier. I think we're doing something right. Four, four suppress, four suppress. Five. We need swords, we need swords, we need swords. Yes, pick up, pick up the fucking swords. We can. Oh my up. god. We have to get oh, enlightened. I can't. We have to get enlightened. We have to get enlightened. All right. Okay, All right. everyone run around. Yeah, you might, run might run need to we're suppress them again. again. Just, just. Yeah. Okay. Just say when you say when you have a thing. I'm gonna get you if you're a pup. No, don't, oh, don't fight. Don't me. fight. Don't fight. Just get suppressed. I mean, get just get. They're, we're faster we're than. Tell me when you have it. Tell me when you have it, Artemis. Someone's saying. Wait, to these be are ready. sword bearers. Just stand on someplace high. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, take, take, take. Someone take. 
Dip dip how long? Take thank you. Yep. And then mustard is gonna take from juicy. And then should I take from mustard or Wait, why don't we just start attacking, Spark? Uh, I'd rather not. Okay. No, get it. It's when just more safer to have five yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah you I should press more with five people attacking, it would be crazy. Alright, dunking. Good ball, good ball. Get them all on the well, and then, yeah, suppress it like this. Gang up. Get bring them fucking. Up on this fucking bitch. And then bring them in. Oh my god! Bro, oh, we're just jumping, so man. Keep suppressing. Insane, insane, insane. Wait, I might die. Ah! Are you good? Die. There's a well behind you. Press that bitch. Oh my god! What a oh satisfying god. ending. Just <laughs> smash them to bits. Oh my god, I got a chest piece again. Fuck Unleashing my rage, hey? Oh. I got the shotgun. I got the shotgun too. Ah. That was so right anticlimactic, there. but holy fuck. Okay, so second encounter. Um, Honestly, this really wasn't that bad. This was probably the shortest encounter of all four of them. Um. The ads weren't an issue. The main issue was just getting people over to the other side because the way this works is if you don't have two people on like a little plate, a nuke will go off. And the issue is just for us to stop a nuke from going off and also trying to get people to go from one side. But once we figured this out, it was actually pretty easy. But I mean, of course, from our amazing success from the first encounter, the first thing we try to do is just cheat it. Do this blind or do you just want to pull up raid secret? Let's, let's do it blind. We, we did the first part easily, oh, okay? We're, smart. we're gonna find you smart way again. Watch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> shatter skate all, right. all the way we to the back end. Back we can just, we can just okay. well skate over there. Fuck I was it. about to say shatter skate blind. all the way to the end. We're all happy about completing the easiest encounter regarded in all of Death. <laughs> Yeah. Look, it's not easy for us, okay? <laughs> yeah. we, are, we are within the lower IQ bracket. <laughs> I think it's just the four totems we have to keep active, okay. not the... What are the, the wizards? Once, and and once where the are bridge they? is built, it's built. You know what I mean? What I, mean? Like, I, don't, I think, I think we have to kill a gatekeeper and then wizard spawns. Yeah, oh, wait. Yeah, he's... Oh! He's oh! Right. Yeah, but... We still need to get the sword there. Oh, we would, but then we can have more people there. Yeah. But the thing is, the person that's going there needs to be good at that clear, basically. I... Spoiler alert, this is actually somewhat of a decent game, and none of these cheats worked. So, we had to do it the right way, the way it was intended. I know, disappointing. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Three, two, one. We're getting like way closer. I hope you guys see that. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, we are. Mm. Dip, are you, uh, yeah, I'm on. enlightened? Yeah. yeah. Alright, there you go. At least I know I'm gonna be able to teach this raid really well. Juicy, take. Nah, never mind. I'm enlightened. So, Felix, I'm take it to mustard. Right, I'm running back to mid, or should I get ready to pick it off Juicy? Get ready to pick it off Juicy. Get ready to pick it off Juicy. And then do yeah, I just 50%. run for it? Uh, yeah. Dip yeah. has, yeah. Plan dip has planted. Dip has yeah. planted. You're good, you're good. Just believe. I'm just gonna strand it. Okay. Over here. Yep, I know. Are we done on bridge? Are we done on bridges? Run, 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 run. Yeah, yeah. get off, get off. You can get off, you can get off. Alright, good work, boys. Good okay. stuff. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, um, now just take uh, take a breath, and then the three will figure it out. I'm ready for that. You're on the way? Okay, okay. Time when you're completely over bridge. so I can get off my plate. The bridge is not even there yet. What? Yeah, oh, the bridge is just building. Building. You could jump and smack, you'll be faster. Okay, I'm and here. everyone get off, everyone get off, everyone get off plates. Yep. Where am I going? Uh, Sorry, heading my way. Okay, I see it. You see the guy? You see the guy, blue guy? You can get off, you can get off. Yep, yep, yep. Waiting for Artemis. Hang on. I'm you're on good, you're good. Take your time. Not trying to rush you. Oh, I was good. Take your time. Take your time. Okay. Don't rush. Don't All rush of you are time. gonna have to grab a sword. I believe. Uh, there we go. Here it comes, here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. I don't know where it is yet. On spark, on spark, on spark. Everyone off, everyone off. On spark, on spark, everyone off. On spark. Yep. What now? 
Oh, we just keep going. Play. Play game. Wait. There's a pedestal. There's a pedestal. Do we have to run right here? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put your sword in there. No, 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 no. There's a pedestal up in front of the, you know. What do you call there's it? a barrier. Yeah, I think we're doing something right. Four, four suppress, four suppress. Five. We need All swords. We need swords. We need swords. Yes, pick up, pick up the fucking swords. We can. Oh my god. We have to get oh, enlightened. I can't. We have to get enlightened. We have to get enlightened. All right. Okay, All right. everyone, everyone run around. Yeah, you run might just suppress them again. again. Just, just. Yeah. Okay. Just say when you say when you have a thing. And we get you if you're a pup. No, don't, oh, don't fight, don't me. fight, don't fight. Just get suppressed. I mean, get just get. We're faster than. Tell me when you have it. Tell me when you have it, Artemis. Someone saying flip. Wait, to these be are ready. sword bearers. Just stand on someplace high. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, take, take, take. Someone take. Dip, dip. How long? Take. Thank you. Yep. And then mustard is gonna take from juicy. And then should I take from mustard or? Wait, why don't we just start attacking, Spark? Uh, I'd rather not. Okay. No, get it. It's when just more safer to have five yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah you suppress them all with five people attacking. It'd be crazy. Alright, dunking. Good ball, good ball. Get them all on the well, and then, yeah, suppress it. Like, yeah. Gang up. Get Gang up fucking. On this fucking bitch. And then bring them in. Oh my god! Bro, oh, we're just so jumping good. them. Keep suppressing. Insane, insane, insane. Wait, I might die. Ah! Are you I'm dying. There's a well behind you. Press that bitch. Oh my god! What a oh satisfying god. ending. Just oh. smash them to bits. Oh my god, I got a chest piece again. Fuck Unleashing my rage, hey? Oh. I got the shotgun. I got the shotgun too. Ah. That was so right anticlimactic, there. but holy fuck. Continuing on to the fourth encounter, the last encounter of this raid. Now, we're feeling kind of skeptical because the third encounter took a lot of our time, about, like I said, 14 hours. So it went into half a day two. So we were kind of stressing. We didn't really have a day three and went through five different teams. And we didn't even get it done on day two. So this was a race against the clock. The encounter is pretty simple. It's in the same room. You just need the buff in order to pick up a sword. And once you have the sword... You hit Crota, you break his shield, and then you can damage him normally. And one person has to shoot this really cool fucking badass eyeball in the sky or else it will blow us all up. And that was it. It's honestly really simple. It was just us and a race against the clock. We had about 10 hours left to complete this. Gosh, after non-stop deaths and just wasting three hours, it was about two o'clock at night and we were just done. Me and Rohan were so over it. I was like, I'd rather just not do this anymore. But 
I still had a little bit of time. I still had about seven hours to go. So my plan was to go take about a four or five hour nap, wake up early in the morning and just finish this. Just get it done with. <laughs> so remember that four hour nap I said I was gonna take? I may or may not have slept in and I basically woke up at around 11 and started panicking because this thing ended at two o'clock, meaning I had three hours. And on top of that, I had to find a team to work with. So I had about an hour and 30 left when I started. And I'm gonna be honest with you, this went awful. We couldn't even get to the first stage. And then the final, the final run hit. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm about to, uh, whoever's grabbing it off me, come grab it. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Got it. Alright, and then we just need to not die. Sword bear is right here. I have sword. Alright, come over here and just... Alright, that's not who I thought it was. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna grab... Oh, shit. We have no reses. No, I have, I have one. Yeah, uh, yeah but that's no. three or four. Yeah, that's four. That's still four. Well, it was a nice little race. Yeah. And there's the reset. Well, that's amazing. So, that right there, that little symbol right there was the reset basically telling us that it was over and I couldn't get it. And it was honestly frustrating and sad. I just wasted about two days of my life grinding for something that I have to do all over again. It was honestly one of the worst things ever. So after this, I was just upset. So I shut off the game and I took a shower. And then this happened. So I thought Rohan wanted to call to either tell me he got it or just to talk about our runs, but this is what he had to say. All right. We're still dropping that Kakasa, but we have to be like really fucking quick. So everyone knows what to do, right? Well, uh, uh, we have to hurry up or we're probably not going to get that Kakasa because they're probably going to back people out, dude. Yeah. So what he was saying was it wasn't day one challenge mode anymore. So it wasn't as hard as it should be. Instead, it was easier. And there was a glitch going around where you could still get the rewards even after the day one event ended. So now it was still, again, a race against the clock. We had to get a team. We had to make sure they knew what they were doing. And we had to complete it all before this glitch got patched. And that was in a matter of minutes that this could have happened. Now, as soon as we got a team, we immediately started going straight away. Everyone knew what they were doing. And this moment, this moment right here, this will determine if I've wasted three days of my life. This exact moment. And then this happened. Christ. Yeah, right oh. now. Oversoul, you can shoot it whenever you want. Oh, okay, he's dead. It doesn't matter. I'm expunging. Oh, wow. We expunged just so much more now. Oh, Oversoul, Oversoul, shoot it, Oversoul, shoot it. Yeah. GG. Go grab your Necro Chasm. GG. Oh, let's go. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for controlling. Hey, no, no, no. You're, you're completely fine, dog. We did it. We did it. Oh, Wait, I is this still dropping it. loot too? No, it's yeah. not. What else? Did I you guys think... get your Necro Chasm? Necro Chasm. Yeah, what do you grab it? Yes. So, we did it. We actually did it. We basically completed the raid and day one it. Maybe by a short glitch, but it is what it is. The lesson you should take from this is never do a fucking day one raid. It is the most painful shit ever. Unless you're going for first in the world, which good luck with that. Never do it. It's not worth it. Destiny 2 isn't even worth it. But also... You can also take away the fact that you should never give up because you never know. Some bullshit glitch might actually help you win. Ow.
Continuing on to the fourth encounter, the last encounter of this raid. Now, we're feeling kind of skeptical because the third encounter took a lot of our time, about, like I said, 14 hours. So it went into half a day two. So we were kind of stressing. We didn't really have a day three and went through five different teams and we didn't even get it done on day two. So this was a race against the clock. The encounter is pretty simple. It's in the same room. You just need the buff in order to pick up a sword. And once you have the sword, you hit Crota, you break his shield, and then you can damage him normally. And one person has to shoot this really cool fucking badass eyeball in the sky or else it will blow us all up. And that was it. It's honestly really simple. It was just us and a race against the clock. We had about 10 hours left to complete this. Gosh, after non-stop deaths and just wasting three hours, it was about two o'clock at night and we were just done. Me and Rohan were so over it. I was like, I'd rather just not do this anymore. But I still had a little bit of time. I still had about seven hours to go. So my plan was to go take about a four or five hour nap, wake up early in the morning and just finish this. Just get it done with. <laughs> so, remember that four hour nap I said I was gonna take? I may or may not have slept in, and I basically woke up at around 11 and started panicking because this thing ended at two o'clock, meaning I had three hours. And on top of that, I had to find a team to work with. So I had about an hour and 30 left when I started and I'm gonna be honest with you, this went awful. We couldn't even get to the first stage. And then the final, the final run hit. Uh, yeah. yeah. No. <laughs> okay, I'm about to, uh, whoever's grabbing it off me, come grab it. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Got it. Sword bearers right here. I have swords. Alright, come over here and just... Alright, that's not who I thought it was. Because they've died. Yeah. Yep. So I'm gonna grab... Oh, shit. We have no reses. Yeah, that's, that's a wipe. No, I, ha I have one. Yeah, uh, yeah but that's nope. three or four. Yeah, that's four. That's still four. Well, it was a nice little race. Yeah, well, and there's the reset. Oh, that's amazing. So that right there, that little symbol right there was the reset. 
basically telling us that it was over and I couldn't get it. And it was honestly frustrating and sad. I just wasted about two days of my life grinding for something that I have to do all over again. It was honestly one of the worst things ever. So after this, I was just upset. So I shut off the game and I took a shower. And then this happened. So I thought Rohan wanted to call it either tell me he got it or just to talk about her runs. But this is what he had to say. All right. We're still dropping that Kakasa, but we have to be like really fucking quick. So everyone knows what to do, right? Well, uh... Uh, we have to hurry up, or we're probably not going to get in because they're probably going to back people out, dude. Yeah. So what he was saying was, it wasn't day one challenge mode anymore. So it wasn't as hard as it should be. Instead, it was easier. And there was a glitch going around where you could still get the rewards even after the day one event ended. So now it was still, again, a race against the clock. We had to get a team, we had to make sure they knew what they were doing, and we had to complete it all before this glitch got patched. And that was in a matter of minutes that this could have happened. Now, as soon as we got a team, we immediately started going straight away. Everyone knew what they were doing. And this moment, this moment right here, this will determine if I've wasted three days of my life. This exact moment. And then... This happened. Christ. No, no. 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 Well, first of all, you can shoot it whenever you want. Oh, okay, he's dead. It doesn't matter. I'm expecting. Oh, wow. We expunged just so much more now. Oh, Oversoul, Oversoul, shoot it. Oversoul, shoot it. Yeah. GG. Go grab your Necro Chasm. GG. Oh, let's go. I'm, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry for controlling. Hey, no, no, no. You're, you're completely fine, dog. We did it. We did it. Oh, Wait, I is it still dropping it. loot too? No, it's yeah. not. What else? Did you guys get your Necrochasm? Necrochasm? Yeah, yes, do you grab yes. it? Yes. So, we did it. We actually did it. We basically completed the raid and day one did it. Maybe by a short glitch, but it is what it is. The lesson you should take from this is never do a fucking day one raid. It is the most painful shit ever. Unless you're going... For first in the world, which, good luck with that. Never do it. It's not worth it. Destiny 2 isn't even worth it. But also, you can also take away the fact that you should never give up. Because, you never know, some bullshit glitch might actually help you win.